in the aftermath of the Beijing Olympics, we met up with a former Olympian who also starred on the rugby pitch. Before playing on the wing for Wales, Nigel Walker was a top hurdler. His career began at Mendy Athletics Track in Cardiff. Well, it's amazing coming back here. I haven't been here for probably 20 years and uh, it brings it all flooding back, to be perfectly honest, because it was often like this, overcast or bitterly cold or there was snow on the track. And we just knew we had to put that work in if we were going to get uh, what we wanted to achieve during the summer. In terms of the field, the cinder has disappeared. It was a six-lane cinder track, but nothing else has changed. Um, and to think that I spent many, many hours here um, during my youth is... Oh, it really does bring it back. And all those years have, have just gone and, and now I'm a, a middle-aged man thinking about it. And at the time, you know, had the best years ahead of me. Uh, absolutely fascinating, breathtaking. In the early 80s, Walker took on and beat the likes of future world record holder Colin Jackson. He competed in the 1984 Olympics in Los Angeles, but when he failed to qualify for the 1992 Games in Barcelona, Nigel decided to return to a sport he'd loved as a child. Well, when I told Colin Jackson that I was good, this was going to be my last season and I was going to start playing rugby, his quote was, um, and I quote him verbatim, they'll break you in two, I'll come and see you in hospital. Um, he said it with a smile on his face, but he thought perhaps I would, be, I would come a cropper. Those fears were unfounded as Walker used his blistering pace to keep out of trouble. Although the transition from lone athlete to playing in a team was difficult at first. It was quite a culture shock because I was 29, 30 at the time. Um, so from being totally responsible for everything I did, I was then being told what to do. Um, but once you got past those things, I mean, playing rugby, especially in Wales, playing for Wales, oh, it just changed my life completely. Walker played 17 times for Wales, scoring 12 tries. And don't ask him to choose between his memories of athletics and rugby. Well, I'm fortunate I've done both. Uh, I'm not giving one back, I can tell you that for nothing. Um, uh, people have asked me, winning a gold medal or score a try for Wales? Well, winning a gold medal on your own would be quite some achievement. Um, I didn't have the ability to win a gold medal on my own. I got to the semi-finals of the Los Angeles Olympics, scored a few tries for Wales, and they're treasured moments indeed.